Welcome back to the BMO Harris Bank Center. Slav Kobekovic joined by newly returned Ice Hogs forward Rostislav Olish. Oli, thanks for the time. First of all, uh, long road of recovery for you. How do you feel physically? Physically, I feel good. Just getting the game situation and game legs. You know, game is game. You can practice. Uh, when you're practicing, obviously, you don't get that timing on the ice. You have to be out there working and playing with your teammates in game action. What's the biggest adjustment so far for you? Well, get uh, get used to the people on the ice because I've been skating by myself for six months probably. So it's been so different skating with the guys, making like passes and shooting on the goalie. What's been the toughest part of the recovery for you? First, uh, first three, four months after surgery, when you have to get your like muscle back and movement and joint movement and everything. You were one of the top scorers last season for these Ice Hogs. Now, obviously, in the playoff push again this year. What is the team compared uh, this season compared to last year? How would you compare the two squads? I don't know. It's hard to compare because uh, beginning of the season was low so a lot of a lot of players playing here and in, in all league. But uh, last year I played here. All, I think almost 50 games, and this year I played like so far three, four games, and it's it's so hard. Like it's like try catch the train and trains going, so uh -huh. just try try jump in and uh, play my best game so far. But it's uh, pretty, not far, but it's, it's still not there yet. What are your expectations for the rest of the season to help the team and, and just for your game individually as well? Just win every game. That's that's the bottom line. Like I just wanna, I wanna try win every game, and doesn't matter what was the score. If I scored three goals, or I didn't score. Just just win the game. It's the most important thing right now. Yeah, you, know, you made the comeback last week in Abbotsford. You guys got three out of four points, so good for the team. But you also contributed a pair of big goals for the, for the team. How did it feel for you to be able to come right in and comp contribute right away and give a big goal to tie the game with 10 seconds left? Yeah, it was big goal. You know, it's uh, it's like you you dreaming about it. You know, when you're coming back, you want to score goals, but it's never is like it's happened like right away. The things, these things, and it's taken a little while to get used to like timing, like I said before, and the game situation, and it's a lot of things. Hockey is a fast game, and if you don't practice with the team for a long time, I think I was practice for one week with the team and just start playing right away. So. Obviously in the AHL, lots of roster turnover as well. The teams that you're, you guys will be playing this weekend are different, obviously, than teams that were even in the first half of the season before the lockout. How much do you know about teams that you guys have played, Milwaukee's, Oklahoma City's? I know Milwaukee a little bit. We played them many times last year, so I know a few players from there. And Oklahoma City, we played there I think, twice last year. Yeah, it's hard. The lineup changes every day. Right? Yeah. So we can play team back-to-back, -back and they can have a different lineup every single night. Well, Oli, thanks for the time and yeah. best of luck Thank the rest you. of the season. Thank Welcome you. back to Rockford. Thanks. All right, that's Ice Hogs forward Rostislav Olish. We'll be back with more on the Ice Hogs Broadcasting Network.